EA Sports. Here we've got a pair of running backs. We're hoping their number will be called plenty in today's game. It's the Packers going up against the Lions. Now let's head down to Jim Nance and Phil Sim for this Week 14 matchup. Lions-Packers on EA Sports. Winter is here as the temperature continues to drop as we get set for kickoff for today's matchup. Hello, friends. Jim Nance and Phil Sims getting set for the call. The playoff chase is on. It's late in the year, and every single game is crucial. How about the scene we have before us, Phil? Now just wipe the slate clean, Jim. That's what you got to think of as players and coaches. Don't worry about mistakes that you've made in the past. Or some of the good things, this is it. One game, it means everything. And if you have that kind of attitude, I think it really helps you play better physically and mentally. And of course, if you do that, it gives you a better chance to win. The Lions are back deep, waiting for the kick return. The leaders of the NFC North are set now to kick it away and get this game started. And a touchback here will bring the ball out to the 20. And now we've got a young quarterback about to head onto the field for the first time today. Uh, you know, Jim, this guy's he's he's starting to inch his way up into that elite status, and, and he keeps playing solid football. So if he goes out here today and, and plays a good solid game again today, we're gonna we're gonna start talking about him differently here in the future. Hooks is lined up now as a slot receiver. First down at the 20. And this pass goes incomplete as he was looking short that time. And now let's take a look at the Lions offensive lineup. One of the strengths of this offense, its ability this year to convert on third down. One of the best in the league. Second and ten. They'll run it here. That's a gain of six. That's a nice, powerful statement as they establish the run at the beginning of this game. Jim, I, you're, you're right. I'm going to give the offense a little credit here, but, you know, somewhere, I don't know, maybe the defense going to have to put some weights in their pockets. you got to hang in there and make the tackle. The Lions come out and a two tight end set. Third and four to the ground. That's a gain of 10. So many times you watch football games and coaches just give up too early on the run game. Well, they'll keep it going today after that run. Decent pickup by the running back. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. The Packers' defense now is going to go nickel. Trying to beat the play clock. The give. Brought down after a gain of six. The defense doesn't want to give up runs like that, so how do they stop it? Well, they start crowding the line of scrimmage, so you keep crowding that line of scrimmage. Look out, they'll throw it over the top. The Packers with a nickel look here on defense. Second down, three to go. Looking across the middle, Ebron's got it. First down. Can't pick it up a couple first downs early in the game. It's Well, it's like when you play golf and you par the first couple holes. I know it doesn't happen a lot, but when you do, it makes you feel good. First down at the 49. Here, fumble. And it's a takeaway. Tackles made. Here comes a Super Bowl MVP quarterback, Aaron Rodgers.
First down, offense readying for the snap. And Rodgers will hand it off. He's going to be tackled right around the 46-yard line. Now that we've got a moment, let's look at the Packers' offense. Last week, they were motoring up and down the field, throwing for over 350 yards. That leads us to second down. Shorts, a receiver in the slot. Play action. Aaron Rodgers way down the field. Interception. And no return this time as he takes a knee. Well, as a quarterback, I think the biggest thing is when you throw an interception early in the game, you just got to have faith in what you did all week in practice. Keep your confidence level up and come out here and get it done. First down here. The Lions go with two tight ends on this play. Handoff made. That's a gain of seven. Hard to judge sometimes what time of possession really means in an NFL game. But I know this. When you run the football like that and you pick up decent yards, that's a good thing for the offensive side and a great thing for your football team. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. Second down, three for the first. And looking underneath, this will go incomplete. And now, here's the Packers defense. Virtually no one has run on this defensive unit this season with any success. The Lions with a third down play coming up and hoping to improve in this category versus a week ago. Get ready. The Lions from the 27th will run it. Here's the handoff. Games in the NFL can hinge on third and short. Who can pick them up and who can stop them? How about that play that time by the defense? They stopped the third and short run, and now it's fourth down. Fourth down, close to the first, so the offense stays on the field. There's a lot of extra weight out there for this jumbo set. The Lions will take the snap from the 30. Another handoff, falls on the ground. The tackle is made. Well, the defense always says, let's cause some fumbles. Then when you cause it and you're not able to recover it, that is one emotional letdown. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Cooks lined up in the slot. Makes the catch in open space. And they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. Another name for the fly route, the go route, it's a streak. And that means they want you to be a blue streak, run as fast as you can, get by that defense, and make a big play. That long gain sets them up here on this play. After the long gain, let's see what they do here. Ebron's got the catch and the first. The catch is made for the first down. Corner routes are not thrown enough in this league anymore. A lot of teams don't do it because it takes a strong arm quarterback to get it done. That was a terrific throw up the field that time. 
they bring in the extra tight end. First down at the 32. Here's the handoff. He's going to be tackled right around the 21-yard line. The Lions offensive line is just Number whooping 10. some tail today, the aren't ball. they? What a job up front. That helps the running back get in space, get down there, and pick up a big game. First down here after the run. It's a two tight end formation. Get ready. For some daylight up the middle. Hey, this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time they stopped that run just for a short game. The defense comes out of the dime. Let's go. Second down and seven. And he's taken down. My gosh, you're talking about getting overpowered. I guess they were expecting a speed move. The right guard and right tackle are both. Marching down the field and taking their time. Take it down. This will be a field goal attempt from 53 yards out. They better hurry to get the snap. Did not beat the play clock. The Lions call on the punting team. Signals and makes the fair catch. First down on the way. Drop it back now into the shotgun makes the reception. He'll pick up seven this time. That's a nice route on the outside. Nice throw by the quarterback. Puts him in good position to keep moving and get a first down. That short pass play picked up six. It's now second down and four. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. After a short delay, now they'll run it. Can't find space and this will be a loss of one on the play. Here's the Lions defense. Last week, this group came up with three forced turnovers. Line up now on third down. They were very good at converting these situations a week ago. They've come out in the dime package. Third and...
He's going to challenge the punt coverage. This big return is going to set up his team in excellent field position. you got to be tough and aggressive as a punt returner in this league. That time, what a good job. Catch it, get right up the field. Nice yardage. First down coming up. The Lions lined up in the pistol. First and ten. He's looking to the right here on this throw. The Lions now.